just love beauty. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and to the world of Craig. Now you may already know that I am a huge beauty fan. And if, well, if you're new to my channel here and you haven't watched any of my videos before, then hello. But if you're coming back for more, then hello and thank you for coming back for more. So I'm a huge beauty fan. I do have some other beauty videos here on my channel and I'm often talking about beauty in my stories on my Instagram, which of course, as always with us YouTubers, will be linked down below. So you can go check that out. But I'm a massive beauty fan. So I thought it made sense as we're in the middle of the summer to do my beauty favorites roundup. So first up, it's the Shang Pri Marine Energy Eye Mask. Now, I hope I pronounced that correctly. Shang Pri, I think it's not too confusing. But I recently bought these from a K-Beauty pop-up um, in Soho that was opposite my gym. Now I've used them maybe, uh, I think about six times, half a dozen times. I will pop an insert of me earlier on today prior to filming this video. I'm not gonna put them on my face now, I could, and obviously show you guys what they look on, but I'm gonna insert a little video of me here in them earlier. Yeah, that's me. So I'm really into these for a few different reasons, but first of all, let's have a little look at what they've actually got in them. So the Shang Pri Marine Energy Eye Mask. So there's 60 um, kind of servings, if you like, 60 of the actual little masks, and they are like a Oh, if I just, they come with a little spoon inside here to actually pick them out so you don't put your fingers in and contaminate what's inside. And they have like a protective layer on the inside as well. But if you take this off carefully without tipping all the solution out, if I can do that, you can see, I think you can just about make out that they're like little cellulose eye masks that go underneath your eyes. And these ones contain, put it back on before I spill, they obviously sit in a liquid that is what is soothing and comforting to the eyes and does the, does the stuff. So I'm just gonna put a lid on before I spill them everywhere. So let's just have a little look at their website and it says a spa care system eye mask with vitamin E, the vitamin E rich formula with spirulina and marine complex, which would make sense because they are called marine eye masks. Um, strengthens the delicate eye skin, leaves skin revived and energized. Skin feels soothing and healing. Skin feels soothing and healing, I guess. Might be some lost in translation there and they're good for tired eyes now that is the thing that i would really say that these are great for is tired eyes i am the puffiest eye person in the morning when i get up and it takes a while to go down um i'm not a jump out of bed person anyway in the morning it does take me a while to sort of like come round, if you like from being asleep but i do find that these are really soothing and cooling i just leave them on under the eye as you saw in the lovely demonstration video I leave them on for like 20 minutes, half an hour. This morning I left them on whilst I was shaving. So I put them on underneath my eyes, had a shave, they did the job, but they get very cool and sort of soothing to the eyes. And definitely there's like a slight sort of tightening sensation. So I'm really into the Shang Pri, I quite like saying that. Shang Pri. So again, Marine Energy Eye Masks. I think they were about um, 30 pounds. So 60, 30 goes, because you've got two eyes, obviously. 60 goes for 30 pounds. So next up, it's something that's not new to me, but something I've come back to using again after having like a hiatus, if you like, and that's Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. Now, it's a facial spritz. It's not rocket science. It's a toner, obviously. I love the pump on this one. It's got a really great pump. It's not one of those ones that like completely saturates your face. It's a really light spritz, if you like. Now, I used this a couple of years ago, stopped using it because I've got so much else that, to use and to try. I love trying out new things, but I've come back to using this. I bought this in New York recently, about a month ago. It was boiling hot, really, really dry, and my skin was like really parched. And this did the job. I popped into Urban Outfitters and they had a few bits of Mario Badescu with this line. The Mario Badescu line was set up by a facialist, I think in LA, I think Mario was from LA, and he became a kind of celebrity facialist and started up his own line of products. And I love the fact that they're all in kind of low key packaging and they're kind of simple. They kind of do what they say on the tin, if you like. So we've got aloe in here, which is very soothing and calming, and obviously cucumber, which is soothing as well. But this has green tea, which is an antioxidant. Um, an antioxidant, obviously, fights free radicals, helps to slow down aging and 
stop anti stop anti aging is anti aging. Sorry, if I can get my words out properly. And basically, this is one of those things that it slipped back into my routine without me actually realizing. Now this is nearly empty. Now um, I probably will be repurchasing repurchasing this. I've got other things in the cupboard, but I've really been enjoying this. And it's one of those things that slipped into my routine and I've just been using regularly on a daily basis. So that's Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber and green tea. A lot to say in one sentence, but it's a great product. Now, next up, it's something from the pie. Now, if you're subscribed to me here on YouTube, you may have seen my beauty pie overview video. And if you're not subscribed to me here on YouTube, please subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified as to when I post new videos, new content, because there's lots of exciting stuff coming. So I'm a huge Beauty Pie fan, and this is their Super Drops High Intensity Hydration. Now I have already repurchased this. When it first came out, it's quite a new product from the, the Beauty Pie team, from Marcia and the team. When I first purchased this, it sold out really quickly. Um, and they are basically hyaluronic um, drops. Now hyaluronic acid, um, sounds quite scary, but it's already present in the skin. It's in a lot of beauty products at the moment. It's a real buzzword and your skin naturally contains hyaluronic acid, but hyaluronic acid attracts moisture and water. I think it's something like a hundred times the weight of moisture that it actually contains in itself. So it really quenches the skin and really moisturize, moisturizes. Talk properly, Craig. So this has some really quite amazing technology in it and I'm going to read from the Beauty Pie website here um, because the technolo technology goodness, in this is really, really great. So this, I can't speak today. The Super Skin Moisture Plumping Super Drops are like magic with hyaluronic acid, that magical ingredient, black oat aqua rich extract, not sure what that is, but it sounds snazzy which is ultra hydrating, water binding, saccharide isomerate. They really are testing me, thank you. And Ficusel Vita um, to help boost visible firmness and elasticity or elasticity. Massage a few drops onto clean skin under any mask or moisturizer to give your skin a super hydrated glow. Now, I took this on holiday with me to Cyprus. Um, I was in the sun. I don't really put my face in the sun because I don't want to age. So I've always got a hat on and I've got like factor 50 on my face. But I took this away with me and it, again, it's something that has become part of my routine. All of the things that I'm talking about here today, um, glancing over at my chair full of product, are things that have become part of my routine. So if, you know, it's always the way that I buy things, if I try them and I don't like them, then I don't talk about them because why would I talk about things that I don't get on with? I could make a video that bashes them, but that's not really my speed. So. I really love these. The texture of them is like super light. Um, they have a, a really, really super light texture. In the summer months, my skin, I don't know if you guys can pick that up there, but it's just like a really, really light, not watery. It has more of a serum type texture. But in the summer months, my skin is a lot greasier. Um, so I don't need heavy moisturizers. So I've really been enjoying the Super Drops High Intensity Hydration from Beauty Pie. Oh, and if you haven't seen my Beauty Pie overview, I will link it down below. Go and check it out. And if you're not a Beauty Pie member yet, then you really should be. Who doesn't want amazing premium skincare makeup, now body care, which is amazing, at 80% off of the RRP, the recommended retail price? Beauty Pie, yes. Okay, so it's a little bougie and some people might think it's a bit crazy, but I actually, I didn't, I didn't kind of technically buy this myself. Um, I had some Liberty vouchers, so I bought this with the vouchers. So this is by Redo um, Hand Wash and it's in the fragrance suede. Now this, I think it's about 50 pounds. There is, how much is in there? There is, if I look at the front, 450 ml, so nearly half a litre. By Redo suede, I'm a huge fan of their candles, love their candles and I was a bit hesitant to get this because it is ridiculously expensive, but I was treating myself. It was around the time of my birthday. Before we get into what it smells like, I love the soft touch packaging on this. The packaging is to die for. I know I'm a bit of a, you know, a bit of an easy one for packaging, but it's beautiful and it looks beautiful in the bathroom. It's going to be there for quite a while, but this smells, in a word, it just smells expensive. It doesn't really smell masculine. It doesn't really smell feminine. It has that kind of slightly 
um, what's the word for it? Slightly musky, slightly tonka beany, if I'm gonna get all fragrancy about it. A kind of, yeah, just lush. It's just a really lovely, um, chic smelling hand wash. The other thing about this, and the reason that I'm mentioning it to you guys is not just because I love the packaging and because I love the brand, but also because it does leave my hands really soft. My hands are always in water at work, obviously all the time. I shampoo a lot of my own clients but this does leave your skin feeling really, really soft to the point that when I'm at home and I'm using this, I don't actually need to use like hand cream and stuff on my hands. So I'm a huge Byredo fan anyway, but I love the suede hand wash. Now I've lost my train of thought completely. So I'm a huge fan of vitamin C and the Ole Henriksen Truth C Brightening Gel Cream, goodness, long sentence, is a real firm favorite of mine. I bought this about two months ago I was aware of the Ole Henriksen brand. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, I was aware of the brand, but I hadn't really used any of their products. For me, it had always been a, kind of like a spa brand, um, but I think that they've kind of zhuzhed things up and they've changed their kind of strategy and it's become much more about serious skincare. So I love vitamin C. Vitamin C obviously is an antioxidant. We often take vitamin C as a supplement day to day, but it's also great to be used topically, topically Put your teeth in today, Craig. Topically, as an antioxidant on the skin. Antioxidants, as we know, they help fight off free radicals. We talk about that a lot in skincare, but it also um, helps to repair any of the damage that has been done. So this gel cream is a very brightening, um, it's not lightening as such, but a very brightening, and it gives a lot of glow to the skin. So it's got a really light gel texture, okay? so. It has no oil in it at all, so it is water-based. It smells divine, it smells like oranges. I'm not sure whether that would be a fragrance that's been added. I know that the Ole Henriksen products, is, products are naturally derived, but I'm not sure if that's an added fragrance. Let's have a look on the website and get some deets for you guys, rather than me banging on about something that I'm not entirely sure about. So apart from loving to use it. So, delivers 24 hour hydration, brightens, firms, and targets fine lines and wrinkles. The daily effects of stress, fatigue, and pollution can leave your skin looking dry and dull, and nobody wants dry and dull skin, do they? Fight back with Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream, the innovative peachy tinted gel cream. Oh, I didn't know that, so I've been using it, enjoying it, and liking the results, but I didn't know that it actually had a slight peach tint to it. Instantly illuminates and delivers an energizing burst of 24 hour, 24 hour, 24 hour hydration. Creates a smooth hydrated canvas. So let me just check actually if it has. So it has a lot of natural extracts in here. Camellia, um, it says here that the aroma is, let's have a look, that the aroma is natural, that the fragrance is natural. So that really gorgeous citrus fragrance is a natural one, which is good because added fragrance is something that people can be very sensitive to and often react to. So I have, I'm almost down at the bottom of this now, and it is again something that I will probably repurchase. There's a serum that goes with this. There's a whole entire um, Truth Sea Rush. I think the whole line is called Sea Rush or Truth. But there's a whole line that goes with it, and I will be repurchasing this one. So we love this from Ole Henriksen. So last but by no means least, it's Tanlux The Face. So Tanlux The Face, what is that? Well, this I bought by chance on an airplane on the way to my holiday in Cyprus and I bought it duty free because it was greatly reduced. Now this is, I'm kind of like an eighth of the way through it if you like, but that shows you how concentrated it is. It's an additive that you add to your moisturizer to create like a, a fake tan, a faux tan, a tan that develops. It's, they call it illuminating self-tan drops. Now, I've been using like two drops in a nighttime moisturizer twice a week. So that's how you get this kind of um, color that I have at the moment. I don't tan my face at all. Um, I always wear a hat and I wear sunscreen when I'm in the sun because you know I'm a bit older and I don't wanna age my skin. I did in my youth wang it on a sunbed a lot and go out in the sun without sun protection on. So now I'm very careful that I don't put my face in the sun, but I've really been enjoying this from Tanlux. Why do I enjoy it? Well, number one, when it develops, it doesn't have any smell. Um, number two, it you know, the color is really good. It's very subtle. So I've been using two drops in like, um, I guess a sort of 
pea size of moisturizer, of nighttime moisturizer. I've also used it in my Beauty Pie Serum. I've mixed it in with that and it mixes really well. Um, and that's a lighter option, but it does work in well with serums. But I've used it in nighttime moisturizer. And then when you wake up in the morning, your face is tanned. But two drops, they say you can do two drops for a very subtle tan, three drops for a slightly more intense tan, and you guessed it, four drops for a darker tan. Now this is light medium. I think it also comes in medium dark. So this is light medium. And just two drops of it in your moisturizer, apply it, go to bed. You don't wake up smelling like a wet dog or like a digestive biscuit like you do with a lot of gradual um, fake tanners, faux tanners. So the great thing about this as well is it also contains skincare. So it has a uh, raspberry seed extract which is an, apparently an antioxidant, the antioxidants again. So that's anti-aging skincare, but all in the one product. Um, retails for about 35 pounds, I think that's the RRP, but as I said, I bought it duty free and it was reduced, I think it was reduced to about 25 pounds. So maybe you could pick it up when you're going through duty free on your holidays. It really is a good idea to keep the sun off your face. So I am loving Tan Lux The Face Illuminating Self Tan Drops. So that's it for my summer beauty roundup of my new favorite things that have made it into my bathroom cabinet and I'm using on the day today. So do you have beauty products that you think I should be using? Things that maybe would make it into that day to day? Well, of course, you can always leave that in the comments down below. I would love to hear what your favorite things are. What are the things that you can't live without beauty product wise? So if you've enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up and of course, subscribe to my channel. And once you're subscribed, hit the bell notification because it means that you will get notified when I post anything new. The algorithm here is a bit nuts and if you don't do that, you may not see what it is that I post. Thank you so much for coming along and watching this video. And if you'd like to see what I get up to on the day today, then of course you can follow my Instagram, which I'll again link down below. Go and have a look at what I get up to with hair. And of course, there's a lot more beauty on there. But for now, thanks again, and I'll see you all again soon.